Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you all so very much for joining me today. I hope you guys are having the most wonderful day. Today's video is another Home Bargains video. <laughs> guys, I did a huge shop at Home Bargains. I needed to split it over a couple of videos because I think my videos were being getting too long. Um, I think they were touching 20 minutes, 30 minutes. It's a bit long. Um, so I've decided to bring them back to reality, do shorter videos, um, hopefully not have you guys bored. Um, but today's video is going to be a shorter video. It is from um, Home Bargains and I love my little leprechauns made me do it bag. Um, as you guys know, I am Irish. I'm very proud to be Irish um, and I just love this little bag. This bag generally comes everywhere with me. Um, so it's super fun and look at the little leprechaun. But um, let's get started with some of the fun things that, that we got. So guys, I love this um, I love this shampoo and conditioner. If you guys haven't used it, you should really, really try it. It's Anova. I think it's made, it's Anova. It's a UK made product. Um, it's naturally enhanced urolic acid and collagen. I, I struggled to say that. I first used this quite a while ago. Um, didn't really know much about the product. Wasn't too sure about it, but I love it. Leaves my hair feeling super strong super glossy and super clean um it's just fantastic these are a pound um a bottle and i think that's awesome because you're getting 500 milliliters in each um normally i buy because i have longer hair i buy more conditioner than shampoo but they only had one conditioner today so i just bought what they had um and this is infused with hydrating hyaluronic acid and collagen to help enhance a healthy shine hyaluronic acid to promote hair growth and collagen for softer healthier hair and i definitely definitely feel that my hair looks and feels so much healthier when i use these so guys for a pound each shampoo and conditioner in that size of bottle i think is fab um guys i bought these these are senzaroma senzaroma disinfectant wipes there is an 80 pack of wipes it is a new value bag um and the reason that i bought this is because i've never tried these before um it says disinfects in two minutes it's got a lasting fragrance and you can use it on surfaces and hands so if i wanted to clean my hands i have wipes to do that which i'm um very happy about but it's pomegranate and lime a, a scent i've never smelled before so i wanted to buy this to check out Oh my gosh, they smell so good. Um, they smell so fruity and zesty. Um, really, really nice. So I'm I'm pretty stoked about that. These were only um one pound a bag, 80 wipes, um, multi-purpose for um, and the fact that it disinfects in two minutes. I definitely had to get that and try it out. Um, let's see what else we have. I purchased some super noodles. <laughs> Guys, this is not very exciting, however. I purchase Super Noodles every single time I go out. I know a couple of places have put the prices up. Um, some of them are 80p, some of them are 60p. Um, Home Bargains had theirs on at 55p. I buy probably four to six or eight of these um, every month. And I do that in the run up to me going to see my uh, family who live in Canada. They love these curry Super Noodles. You can get these in Canada, but they're super expensive. Um, from I think it's called the British shop um, in my sister's local area um, but they also cost a fortune um, so what I tend to do is buy these in bulk and I pack them in my suitcase and bring them to Canada for my sister um, these are fine to go um, to Canada because there's no meat in them at all it is just the noodle and the flavoring so my suitcase usually has about 30 of these so this is to add to my stockpile um, to put into my suitcase to bring to my sister. Um, guys, I love a squeegee. Um, I have one for my bathroom, but I wanted, I wanted to buy this um, Par Action squeegee to keep down to do my downstairs windows. I just had my windows replaced um, and the window in my living room is huge. Um, and sometimes by the time I get from one end to the other, part of it will dry. And I don't want that because that leaves um, that leaves streaks. So I thought this would be good that I could just squeak, 
squeak squeak across the window do it really really quickly um get it dried off and it will be streak free hopefully that's the idea this little squeegee was 49p i mean that is a total bargain um so i picked that up i'm really really stoked about it super super happy um and now i have one for downstairs i have a tiny little cupboard that i keep some of my little cleaning tools in um and this will fit in nicely there's not a whole lot to it um and it was only less than 50p so that is pretty darn awesome and then guys i just bought a few we'll do these in a moment i just bought a few little things and um, so this video isn't going to be too long um, which is good because I guess you guys don't want to be here oh, all day. Um, but I'll show you what I bought. So let's show you. So I bought these. Um, I maybe have mentioned before that I am trying to be on a health kick, but I have the unbelievable um, problem of having a super sweet tooth. I love rainbow drops. These little rainbow drops, I think per bag, only have 57 calories a bag. Um, they taste really sweet. They take the edge off my craving for something um, really sweet to eat that's not so good for me. Um, so these bags are pretty decent. They're pretty big bags. In this pack, you get four of the bags of Rainbow Drops. It's a multi-bag. Um, they are vegan. They're suitable for vegetarians and they're free from artificial colorings. I mean, that's a pretty decent treat bag for me to kill the cravings for 40 seven calories so i think that's pretty awesome um so that will do me for a little treat while i try i don't know if you guys find it super hard being on a diet but i do and i find it exceptionally hard to stick to that diet but i'm going to try if nothing else i'm definitely a trier i keep on trying and i keep on trying um <laughs> so the next thing i bought was just i mean i bought this because it looked really fun um i purchased this it was 99p from home bargains and i think i got one of these before so this is a magic aquarium and it says that the fish grow more than eight times in their size so you've got these little orbs um well these i don't think are orbs i think these are just little plastic um, balls but you've got two fish you put water in the top and you just let it sit and grow um and i just thought that was cute i'm going to give this to my nephew he will freaking love this it is so stinking cute um so that's a lot of fun a couple of other things that i bought you guys know i am obsessed obsessed with these wickford and co candles these are ones i've never seen before um so i definitely had to pick them up and they only had two the whole shelf was empty apart from these two so i grabbed them these at wexford we'll put one down these wexford and co candles i burn up to 16 hours and they definitely definitely do um and they are um so so they, they, the scent is just so good. They're not as good as Yankee, but they're not far off. Um, this is in Spring Bouquet. I love the um, pastel pink color. And it definitely has that sweet, um, that sweet floral um, scent. So I am super stoked that I got these. 59p for each candle. Look how cute these are. I do not, never, I do never, I do not ever. <laughs> throw away the glass bottles i keep them i keep the lids and when the candle is done i put them in boiling water i pour out the can um the candle wax i collect the candle wax and then i remelt um and put my wick in so i mean i get so much value for my money because not only do i get the candle but i also um get to reuse these little glass jars but these little glass jars are so stinking cute even if you didn't use it for to re um to redo candles you can use these for so many things you can take the little sticker off the front a little bit of hot water will do that um hot soapy water and you guys can use these for um little treat jars which i think are so cute i also bought this um this is a, a vapor wax easy to breathe um vapor candle so it is supposed to be that you burn this candle when you're feeling a little sniffly um and not well and it helps with the breathing wow that is that is that is vix scented um strong strong vix scented i mean i'm not adverse to that um but i thought i'd pick it up and see what it was all about it is super minty um so i'm gonna try out that candle and see what it's like that candle only cost me um 50p it is a teeny little candle but the scent inside this candle and it's made by 
or pure. Um, this little candle has a lot of um has a lot of depth to it. I mean, it has a lot of scent, so that's fun, guys. The other things that I bought um are two. These are real. I love um I love noodles. Um, and I haven't come across a noodle that I think is amazing yet. Um, but I've heard good things about the katsu curry. These are Japanese um, noodles. Um, I'm not going to open this one because I am going to do a Japanese tasting um, video. Um, but I am going to have this one probably for lunch, dinner, mid mid snack and um, so I'm going to show you guys what this one's like but these katsu curry um are supposed to be amazing they're made by Nissin um and this is what it looks like but I am going to make this one so guys what I'm going to do is open it this is a big bowl um and I bet the curry inside is, or the noodles inside are not huge so this is that you can use it for traveling you can use it Eat it with friends. You can eat it with family. Let's look at the instructions. So, peel the lid to peel the lid to the line as per indications provided. Add the seasoning powder. Add the garnish to the bowl. Add boiling water to the mark. Close the lid and leave for three minutes. Remove the lid. Mix well and enjoy. Okay, guys. So, what we're going to do is we're going to do just that. So we open the lid to the marker, and inside the pack. This is what we've got. So we have our noodles right here. I mean, that's not a bad amount of noodles. Um, I was kind of thinking, oh, I'm going to have more pot than noodles. But I mean, that's fine. And then we have, oh, we have a number of things. So we have our garnish. And we have our seasoning pack. It doesn't tell me what these are, but we're going to add these in. If I can, if I can do that successfully. We will add these in. How am I going to do that? Oh, we'll rip it. Maybe? Oh my goodness. I was trying to get through this video um, quickly cut because I am trying to cut my... Oh, guys, so this is red chili in this little packet. And this little packet is curry. So we'll open that. I am trying to cut my videos down just so that they're not 20, 30 minutes long. So I am probably going to pause you guys when I go to... Put the water in and let it sit for three minutes um and then we have our seasoning or we have our toppings is what they're called so we add those in come on all in we want all that yummy yummy goodness in our pot and this is what we have guys i love the fact that you also get a fork that is awesome so guys you stay right there i'm going to be back with you in just a second so guys, we're at our three minutes cooking time for our um, ramen noodles. And guys, just to let you know, these little ramen noodles were only a pound, which I thought was awesome. They are Apollo Dan Boyle. And um, we're gonna rip off our lid and we've got a fair amount of noodles in our bowl. Look at all that definite, delicious flavor. Okay, I went and got a spoon because I want to drink some of that broth, but look at how delicious that looks. Um, I love the little toppings. So we're going to go ahead and taste our noodles. Oh my gosh, this is what is super difficult about noodles. <laughs> you always end up with tons of noodles. Um, I'm just going to turn it. And then we're going to try these mm, delicious noodles. Let's try. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Those noodles are so nice. They are dense, but not unpleasant. They are chewy, and which is exactly what I want. And boy, the flavor. I struggle when I buy noodles with the flavor of the broth. A lot of the brothes don't have that flavor, that kick that I'm looking for. This one, I think the chili has given this one quite a bit of heat. You get that curry flavor, the noodles taste of that curry flavor. Mm, my mouth is literally watering and I want to just taste the broth. I'm going to lift the noodles. That is some really delicious ramen. Um, the noodles are fantastic. The broth is flavorful. You get that little kick of heat. Not too bad. 
Um, definitely not super spicy, but oh my gosh. Guys, I would definitely, definitely buy these again. Um, and I would buy ramen for lunch. Um, so I definitely will buy these again and bring them um, to my workplace um, to have um, for my lunches. So I'm so, so happy I bought those and tried them. Well, guys, I hope you liked this video. <laughs> if you did, please smash that like button. If you're not yet a subscriber and would like to join us, go ahead and hit that um, subscribe button. And if you want to be notified of any of my future videos, just hit the notification bell. Guys, please stay safe. Please look out for each other. Um, and I'm going to catch you next time. Thank you so very much for joining me. I had a blast. I hope you did too. Take care, everybody. Bye.